Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Under Rail. This would be part 64 of our Let's Play. And in the last episode we entered Epione Lab, where we are still to this day. Uh, it's a bit of a shithole. Um, we saw what can only be described as the stuff of my nightmares uh, in, in the Protector of Dreadnought, which looks like some sort of massive powered armor suit and uh, yeah screw that I I don't want any of that and we've managed to get three of the load-bearing pillars god damn it I'm not here okay they, they got me I'm here <laughs> Alright, look, I can maybe take these two guys. I'm just thinking, maybe, just maybe I could get them. Nope. You shush. Wait for his turn off. Okay. And then middle. Right. Total right. Ooh, I was a bit quick. Actually, I was a bit slow. Interesting. So the question becomes, can I... Can I open this door, get the initiative, and maybe lay a stun on one? Didn't get the initiative. You just adrenaline rushed, so that's not not great. Now, if I can lay a stun on you, you won't go, which I did. Damn, those weapons are. Damn, those weapons are harsh. That'll be shield off, yeah. Don't do a tremendous amount of damage, though. Like, they're kind of annoying, but... Unless they crit, like that... They don't seem to be proper kicking my ass. Yeah, I really do suck. You have every right to, uh, hit me with that. Oh, yeah, you have to recharge. Man, that must suck. Uh, do... Seriously. Oh, hi, Sniper. I'm loving the bit where you guys are just, like, straight up attacking me. Okay, you're encapped. Oh, that was... That was dumb. Of course, the lightning damage. Yeah, you went for the alarm, you son of a bitch. God damn it! I should have left him encapped. I should have left him encapped. That was stupid on my part. Okay, that was not a good initiative roll. I, I need to at least go before one of them. Otherwise that happens. Yeah. Like, I need my shield. Uh, I need the shield ready. Okay. I got one of them. Good. Maybe I can actually hit this time. Just a thought. Do I adrenaline rush? I probably should, right? You're gonna come back and shoot me again. Okay, so you did adrenaline rush. Uh... Do I? Oh yeah, I do have adrenaline syringe. Yeah, alright, we're, we're gonna do it. Because I get, what, three turns? Okay, that's one down. So if I go over here, the other one should come and investigate, right? Okay, maybe not. And I might have just wasted that adrenaline syringe. 
Okay, I definitely wasted that adrenaline syringe. Uh, shock troop? Okay, there he is. It's really hard to see the bodies. Uh, yes, I'll grab that. Uh, I don't really need this crap, though. Unless that's better, but I don't think it is. Uh, actually, 28, 22... 25, yeah, okay, mine's got better protection, so... I'll take that over one point of stealth. Blood, sure. Don't see why not. More Rathound barbecue. Kinda want an eel sandwich. If we're being honest. Uh, actually, before I do that, let's recharge this. Because that'll take a little while, and I'd rather not do it with the door open. Okay, so that's that done. We'll just take one of these. How long does it cool down? 20 seconds. Okay. And we'll charge this up. How's it actually doing uh, condition-wise? Uh, kind of low-ish. And do I have... I do have electronic repair kits. Nice, that's mostly full, that'll be fine, it'll do, let's duck around the corner, because that's going to see me, ha, ha 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 ha, ha 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 ha, ha, take that dick, yeah turn that alarm on, ran out of action points, about time that started, Probably happening to other people. That was actually pretty great. Screw that guy. Couldn't activate it because he ran out of uh, action points. Take all this. A lot of saves here. Actually, we're doing pretty well. Doing better than I thought. Like, we had a lot of trouble in the last episode, but... This time we're doing mostly alright. There's been a little bit of, like, saves coming, but it seems to be the, uh... Seems to be the thing to do. Okay, I'm gonna just... Hopefully sneaky-breaky past this. Oh, look at that blood smear. That looks like fun. What's with the nice blood smears? That's a... Oh shit, it's there. You didn't see nothing. Okay. Did they actually see nothing? Oh my god. That actually worked. Wow, eat that. I'll take all this. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, nah, pass. Yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. Bubble gum. An expired pack of, quotes, bubble gum. Old world delicacy that you could allegedly chew for hours. Allegedly. So does that mean these cameras don't work anymore? I took out the, the camera dude. Is that what that means? I hope that's what that means. Biocore technology catalog, or fragment of thereof. Hack level one access. Ooh, security, security cameras turn off. Oh, that's helpful. Which particular storage gate would that be? That one. Ah. I mean, this mostly worked okay. What kind of crossbow is that? Ah, it's just a crappy tornado crossbow. Locked? Yeah. Kind of expected that. Considering there seems to be some goodies behind it. Not really my kind of goodies, but we'll see. Armor plate, eh. And ooh, Molotov. Do you like me a Molotov? Yes, I do. EMP grenade as well is, is pretty handy. Uh, there's more than one of these. Where do the rest of you live? Or did I use them all? Oh no, they're up. Oh, so we've already got ten, right. Uh, eat another one of these. Uh, 
Right, cameras are off. Someone's talking to me on Steam. Just uh, give me a second. Alright, much better. Well, that doesn't sound promising. Uh, yeah, encyclopedia fragments, some taurine, which we don't really use, but maybe we'll find a use. Yeah, you know, I was about to say, is this going to give me, like, hypothermia as well? And you know what? It did. Or it is. In the process of. That's kind of annoying, really. Yeah, and now I have hypothermia. And that lasts two minutes. Like, you have to be kidding me. Alright, whatever, let's, uh, while we're waiting for that to wear off, let's extract some humor, shall we? Nice, bit of blood, some acid, ah, uh, which we can't actually, oh no, we can get it, we can't use it. Right. Right. Uh, lockpicking 60. Anything to waste time while we wait for this to go, go away. Ah, uh, bandage, nice. But this desk. Man, everybody wants me at the moment. It's not important. The one day where everybody wants me for stuff. Yeah, so we're gonna drop that. I don't know why I bothered. Um, morphine shot, we're absolutely gonna learn how to make that. And you know what? Let's see what that entails. Literally just morphine and a syringe. Yeah, we can manage that, I think. Jesus, that's easy. That's easier than bloody health hypos. Unbelievable. I mean, to be fair, what did I expect? Like, it's morphine. You literally just put it in a syringe. Like, we already have the morphine. You just can't drink it. So, yeah, alright, I, I guess you win this round, but I don't know, I expected maybe it had to be mixed with something, I don't know, I'm not an expert, I didn't go to medical school, I didn't do biochemistry, also is old Mr. What's-His-Name going to be around the corner? Okay. So, wait, son of a bitch, there's a load-bearing pillar in there. There was a guy in here, right? Yeah, there absolutely is. Yeah, still weak? Huh? Huh? Still weak? You want some more? You can do this all day. That's what I thought. Weak my ass. Says a person wrapped up in a steel suit. Sorry, my phone's just gone off off its nut. <clears throat> do, do, do. What's through door number one? Okay, so it seems to be like that one's kind of in the middle, this one's at this end, this one's at that end, there's one there, so the other one's gonna be up in this corner. For sure. What if I just switch this off? Lock picking 50. Can do. What happens if I switch this off? Hacking 50. Well, you know what? I can do that too. The man of many talents. <sighs> this dreadnought's on the other side. I don't even know what what a dreadnought entails. Like, what... What are you? Wow. Wow, okay. Uh, 
pretty shit is what it is. How the hell am I going to defeat this? Uh, okay. I have an idea. I have an idea about how I'm going to defeat this. And I'm going to need some of those nice EMP grenades. <sighs> maybe go this way. Because I can maybe get him to chase me. And you'll have to use up all his points, because he has a lot of action points. Two bursts, and then a single shot? Are you kidding me? Okay, he's still after me. Can I go, like, here? Okay, but he must be really heavy. Short-circuited, so he's stunned? Yeah, good. Leg it! Don't want none of it. Don't want none of it. Okay. You can chase me in there. This is unexpected. I did not think you'd be able to uh, do that. I just, uh. I just do nothing, apparently. You know what else I didn't do? You've probably noticed my mistake. And that is, I didn't turn my friggin' shield on. Okay, so that, that. Is there anything else that would be useful? Uh. Probably morphine. Did I not take... Oh, no, I did take Adrenaline Rush. Wow, that's... Okay, okay. We had the right idea. How the can open doors? I know that seems like a silly question. But I wonder if it can open doors. What do you... What? I, I... My brain hurts from that. Hello? How's this taste, dick? Okay. He didn't mind it. Okay, so there he is. Now, if I go, like, here, I should be able to throw one, say, there. Without getting myself. Can I dose myself and switch my shield on? Now the question becomes... Can he open doors? The answer may surprise you. <laughs> I suppose this isn't going to work. Okay. Yeah, so it's the lightning that's actually doing like 90% of the damage. Not surprising. Uh, I should... Right, fatigue. Uh, that's a problem. I'm confident we can win this, though. We can just run him around in circles. It won't be pretty. Are you serious? Um, yeah, it won't be pretty, but it'll be doable. Actually, do we just... Hang on, hang on, hang on. Do we just open this? And go around? That way I don't have to open it. Because he can open doors. We, we know that now. It seems like I'm just going to have to... Keep kiting him until I can throw a... Uh... EMP. And then just lay into him as much as I can. Hello...
Uh, how far do you get on the first one? You get to like here, right? Yeah. So let's throw it there. Eat it, chomp. Okay. Oh my god! Just... Everybody leave me alone! Guys, I will be right back. Good lord, you would think the world is coming down around me, but it's actually not. Okay. Now, I was gonna... I was gonna adrenaline syringe this, because now that I don't have to open a door... I can outrun it. Of that, I am confident. Okay, let's just... Out of interest, hang on, let's... Let's do that and run. Oh no, he's going to be able to get me and shoot me. Out. Okay. That's valuable information to know, though. So he's still got thing for one turn, which is alright. If we run here, can we still... No, we can't. No way in hell. But now we can use plasma cells. If we use plasma cells, it'll do it in one. Now that's pretty important. Because we do need... Where are you? Oh, you're right there. I don't know which... Okay, he, he did go that way. Genius! The Aussie nerd, everybody. Idiot of the year. Uh, ah, right. Four turn cooldown. Okay, and then we leg it. Because he can absolutely catch up. Yeah, one turn. Good. As expected. Oh shit, you are. Oh shit, I don't have the thing back yet. Oh, I'm dead. Or maybe not. Alright, one more turn and I can EMP in. Uh. Okay, I might just step back a little bit, because. Ah shit! I didn't think he'd be able to hit me from there. Should have known that his range was pretty hefty. Okay, like, that's the strat, though. We we can do that. Because, like, if I go here, he's just there. Yep, let me just, uh... Stun his ass. And we'll dose ourselves and get in there. Kinda wondering, can we afford to just maybe double tap him? And then run? Okay, we kind of can. Like, not really, but kinda. Uh, charge up the plasma cell. Okay. Oh, yep. See, that's kind of what I was afraid of. He went the other way. Okay, he's absolutely in here, right? Yeah. Alright, short circuit. Ah, three turns. Uh, no, we're not going to risk it. We're just going to leg it. Okay, if I go out to here... Okay, yep. Ow. He can still hit me. I think at this stage we've pretty much won, though. Because even if I can throw it, like, there... I can 
He's two turns off. Okay, and I can Adrenaline. This is probably a waste of Adrenaline, but I really want to make sure he's going to die. And that's how we do that. And I'm pretty sure that's like why this area is structured this way. So you can do that stupid kite. Dreadnought Controller. A relatively undamaged Dreadnought Controller. Just holding it in your hand makes you feel like an ace mech pilot. Nice. Plasma Cell. Okay, we recharged with a Plasma Cell so we kind of made it back. Sorta. I mean, we did, but we shouldn't have really had to use it like that in the first place. Uh, good, we can plant that there. I'm really annoyed that the other one's in the freezer, but I guess we can go in and get our hypothermia and whatever and walk out, because there's nobody left. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you to go straight to that. If you would so kindly. Yes, I know. I'm chilled. It's cold in here, I get it. Okay. So I don't know how far away from this we have to get. Obviously we don't want to be anywhere on this level. That that much is absolutely a given. Also, we need to do some recharges. Uh let's let's do that now. So let's recharge the shields first. Most important bit. Power Fist is nice, but the lightning's just kind of an extra. And done. Recharge the Power Fist. Uh, yeah, one little thing off should be fine. Do we check these shelves? Yeah, we, we did. We did check those shelves. Uh, elevator's not working. Interesting. I'll probably just go out the front, set it off. <laughs> done. Easy. <laughs> all in all, that was pretty successful. Like the that dreadnought being in that position was absolutely why they had it sort of roundabout like that. Okay, so now we should just be able to go bleepity bleep. You're too far away. Okay, so we must have to be in this area. I would still argue this is kind of close, but you're the boss. Just out of interest, can we actually head downstairs again? I just want to see. I'm guessing it'll just be like rubble. Oh, no, there, okay, there we go. So there's rubble there, so we can't get around it. Nice. See? See that right there? Smart programming. Although, if you were standing over there, that would be interesting. Okay, maybe I won't call it smart programming just yet. Okay, travel by metro, where do we want to go? Probably to Core City, right? Doopy doopy doo, let's go downstairs. Actually, Zilla. Zilla. Is that as in God? Or as in Mo? Ah, customer, what can I do for you this time? I would just like some eel sandwiches if possible. Maybe like five, because I'm a hungry boy. I'm hungry. Uh, agility by one. That's not terribly useful. Neither is that. Three food sauce. Okay, so let's just sell, say, one of these and two of these. Nice. Alright, let's head back downstairs. If we're lucky, we'll be able to sell some more stuff. Where does this go? Okay, goes into a room full of flies. This appears to be a tip. This pile of junk offers nothing other than an awful reek. The flies, on the other hand, must think otherwise. Okay. Weird that they would have that there. Hm, whatever. Whatevs, whatevs. Yeah, that's right, we had to take the elevator. I was like, I, I don't see that familiar, but... Yeah, we have to take the elevator down to... 
Uh, we'll hit the merchants first. Maybe they've got some more stuff. We can offload some of this other crap as per usual. Now, that area did have the extra, like, zone modifier thing on it that if we got witnessed, we would have to kill everyone. Or the aggression would... would stretch to the entire faction. And I think we killed them all? Didn't we? Pretty sure we did. Pretty sure we did. Derricka... Do you want anything? Uh, two leather armors. Can't help you. One bolt of cloth. Can't help you. But I can sell you these bullets. They're really very nice. Okay, you still got heaps of money. Here you go. And thanking you. Gotta say, bullets are probably one of the easiest ways to make money if you don't use any guns that have bullets. Like, so, sorry, any guns that have bullets. Any any equipment that has bullets. Ah, let's put that there. How many grenades do you want? Three! Okay, have two of those, have one of these. And when I say have them, I mean give me money. And you want what? Nothing else I can really provide. Fair enough. Alphabe. Fabbit. You don't want anything that I have. And Heidi. Um, mostly the same deal. Five chemicals, though. Uh, actually, what am I doing? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's... Uh, where are we? What are they called? They are called... Poison bolts or something? Taser trance... Mine, incendiary bolt, that's not what we're looking for. Chemical bolt, that's what it is. Boom, boom, boom. Maybe not cave here. Let's start with crawler poison. I like me some crawler poison. Do you have any syringes by chance? No. Probably because I just bought them all from you. That's fair enough. No, that's fair enough. Um... Right, let's head back to the Free Drones base and tell them of our success. We blew the hell out of that place. And we can be like, did you see the, see the bzz, bzz, big, big robo murder bot? <laughs> Don't fuck with those. We'll tell, I'll tell stories about the Aussie nerds fight with a robo murder bot for, for years to come. Where he ran circles around it. Punched it to death. <laughs> uh, that's what the story will say. We won't. We won't tell them about the power fist. We won't tell them about the frantically recharging the uh, the power fist. The power fist won't even be mentioned. Ah, uh, one food stuff here. Why don't you have one of these? Because I really don't need to carry that much around. You know what? Oh, actually, you can't have it. Damn it. You sell it, you, you want to buy one foodstuff, but you can't actually afford one foodstuff. <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> uh, rail crossing. Thank you very much. <laughs> a lot of walking in this game. It's not a bad thing. Kinda wish the walking was a bit faster. Like, there's just... There's just a lot of walking. Walking between places that are meaningless. Is what I think the problem is. Like, most RPGs have a lot of walking, but there's a lot of walking through, like, multiple cells that never have any danger, and there's, you know, you, you could, you should be able to skip them. I don't know, just a thought. Just, uh, just gaming thoughts as I'm 
trudging around. Do do do. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. We will. We'll end this episode after we hand in this uh, quest. I think. Because it seems like a, a nice place to stop. We'll finish off what we started in the last episode. Trenton! The elevator has been taken out. Excellent, just excellent. While the cans are in chaos, we can attack the South, on, the South Railroad outpost. Gathered a small team of selected fighters for you to lead during the attack. Who are they? Jazz, Shred, Rocksteady, and Kokoshka. They will be leaving the base immediately. We'll meet you in the area north of South, on, South Railroad outpost. You will then storm the base and eliminate all opposition. Secure the base's elevator, and with that, the embassy below is completely cut off. You have to make the operation as quick as possible. While you're there, I'll be sending different groups of fighters in junkyard and to several potential reinforcement routes, so you won't get attacked from behind. Just in case. Good luck, Aussie nerd. You'll need it. Death to the Protectorate. How do I get to the South Railroad outpost? I mean, I know, but... Take the passage exit near the rail crossing and head southeast until you reach a railway. Follow it, and you'll reach South Railroad Outpost. Okay, easy. So long as stay free. And this is where we're going to end our episode, on a bit of a cliffhanger for the next mission. So, thank you very much everyone for watching. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. If you want to see more content from me, the Aussie Nerd, make sure you subscribe to my channel. If you think you know any friends that might enjoy my content, make sure you share a video or two. I really appreciate it. And finally, if you want to leave any hints, tips, tricks, you just want to say hi, or you want to leave any sort of feedback, make sure you do so in the comments section down below so I can see it. And I will see all of you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.